Round one is done. It's time now for phase two of the prospect redevelopment. And this is what the plans look like for Linwood Square, but what you can't see is the story behind them. 41 Action News anchor Dia Wall is live at 31st and Prospect to share that story. Hey Krista, hey Kevin. So the property here that houses the Lapari Brothers Sunfresh is technically the Linwood Square Shopping Center. It's owned by a father working with his son to take the vision that created what's on the west side of the street and bring it to the east side of the street and beyond. There's a new day on Prospect. Time for phase two of the redevelopment along Prospect Avenue. A lot of people don't look at this area and say, oh, I can go down uh, to 31st and Prospect and get rich, and that's not the intent here. But the goal is to make this area, once a cornerstone for so many in Kansas City, viable again. My very first job was on the corner right up the street on 31st and Prospect. Now, Donald Maxwell owns the property and is leading the charge to redevelop it alongside his son. This is kind of a, what I would call a legacy project. My father built all this, uh, built this shopping center in 1992. So now to, to basically sit side by side with them and be his partner in these ventures is really, uh, it's an honor and it's a blessing. Kansas City invested $17 million into the Lapari Brothers Sunfresh, which opened in June 2018. There were some growing pains when we got started. We've had uh, different public safety issues. We had concerns, but if you look at it now, people are happy about the opportunities they have in their neighborhood. Mayor Quentin Lucas says the store is now financially solvent. The west side of the center is also 100% occupied. It's going to take another $8 million to rehab the east side to look like this. That money coming from a variety of incentives. The city is finally starting to recognize that, well, if you're going to use incentives, we ought to use them for the areas where it's needed. They're digging in to plant a new legacy here. We're going to make sure that the story of Prospect isn't how did we gentrify, how did we change everything. Instead, it's about how we create opportunities that are for the community that is there today. Maxwell tells me they are in talks with an anchor tenant for the east side here. I pushed. He wouldn't tell me who it is, but if they do get a contract, that would mean that the shopping center is 75% occupied. Construction here is set to be complete in April of next year. Live in Kansas City, Dia Wall, 41 Action News.